I wanted to do a mukbang about labels with lesbians because she's a no label. And this nigga just said she was a dyke. Oh, dyke out here in these streets. <laughs> and me? I ain't even a lesbian, bitch. I'm tired of the labels. You ain't no label no more? I'm tired of Okay. Would you like being labeled? Mm -mm. I ain't no label either then. You just said you was a dyke. Not no more. That's what you just said. That's what I said. So you like, changed your mind. Why you change? Why you change your mind? Cause you don't wanna be nothing. I don't wanna be nothing. She ain't being nothing. Nobody being nothing. We ain't nothing. Oh, I'm something. <laughs> What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host, and today I'm back with another video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, share this video. You dig what I'm saying? What a goddamn hair you leak. So listen, first of all, I got my doula with me. Y'all gonna meet her later. I got Cub with me. Cub over here trying to do a thing or two in the kitchen. Trying. But I was over here trying to cook burgers for my people. And then Bird was like, yo, why you ain't, got, why you ain't filming? I was like, because I don't be filming. It. So now I have been forced. Nah. <laughs> I, uh, I cut the camera on, so now I'm gonna show y'all how, you know what I'm saying, I cook my burgers. So yeah, let's tap in. What your burgers called? My burgers called Big Daddy Neek Royalty Burgers. Big Daddy Neek Royalty Burgers. Big Daddy Neek Burgers. Okay, that's all right. Good. So that's what we doing. That sounds good. Now Bird claims she got good angles, so we gonna be the judge of that because she backing up and going forward and backing yeah. and going forward a lot. All right, so we gonna put the onion. In that birth. Alright. We're gonna go ahead and toss in between. So shout out to me and Titi. We got some George Foreman. Uh, uh not some. A George Foreman grief. So I ain't even got to cook these motherfuckers. Come on, Jesus. Oh that? So this is the first time cranking up the uh the George Foreman. The George Foreman. Damn. Y'all need sweet spots. Oh, I see his lips. You see, you gotta come over here. You gotta come over here. Put in a tray. Then you can take that over All right, there. Cause. Yeah. Cool, cuz. That's why we cuz. That's why all you seen with lips. Cause we got them sets of lips. <laughs> why is this? Excuse me. So, y'all, we about to, um, not we. I'm about to put these burgers together. Put a free of them on the, on the, um, George Foreman. And y'all gonna see how the new George Foreman do. All right. So, ain't nothing. How you do your own um, seasoning, cuz? Oh, cuz I forgot you did the meat. Yeah. Don't tell nobody. You ain't. <laughs> All right, y'all, so I almost forgot the seasoning. Who does that? So I use a little bit of slap your mama. All right. Some garlic powder. Uh-huh. Honey hickory. Shout out to uh, uh, Binks. I took this from her Airbnb. All right. She told me to, though. Season salt. You know what I mean? And I got some garlic salt. All right. We gonna let them oop the oop on the scoop the scoop, and then I'll be right back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See? Yep. Ah, right, y'all. I had to take off a bracelet or two. Season again. Put on some lotion, cause allegedly and only allegedly, my elbows ashy as hell. And now, excuse me, excuse me, honey sauce. Okay, love you too. She, she a damn oh, hater. Alright, y'all, let's get these burgers going. Alright, so all you gotta do, you know what I'm saying, roll that thing into a ball, make that whip game proper, like I said. Watch, watch. Yes, <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and throw you on now. <clears throat> now, these is called Big Royce's Big Daddy Long. Going too far. Nick, Nick, edit that out. This is... <laughs> I'm the hell out. <laughs> yeah, you gotta tell yourself to edit it out. Cause I miss it. <sighs> this is... Big Daddy Royalty. Uh, Nick, Royalty Golden Arch Burgers. Alright. This is Big Daddy. <laughs> Big Royalty. Cheeseburgers, you know what I'm saying? That sound better. All right. That sounds good. Whether it sounds good or not, I'll keep it. <laughs> so, the George Foreman can only hold about five burgers. Literally, that's what the pictures say. So, I'm going to wash my hands and 
then I'm, you know, show y'all, you know what I'm saying? Hey. All right, so next you need a little, a little bachelor. To flatten that thing. Uh, come on now. Don't act like that. Yeah, got that sticky icky, don't it? Uh -huh. Good God. I mean, I said two ways, but maybe we need a three. We don't care about having to pull apart, put together, and, and, and fix. No. As exactly. long as them damn burgers taste like burgers. That's what we need. All right, come on now. It's aggravating as hell. I'm going to tell you that damn shit. Why well, I wasn't recording this shit. <laughs> Come on now. Damn. Ah. That sounds good. That's it. All right. So what I like to do as a side is make my own french fry. And I make them from my own taters. Okay. So I'm about to cut y'all some fries. Give y'all a nice little montage. Hopefully a nice little song or something. Mm. I eat my song. And then we're gonna go from there. Nice. Yeah, sure. It's just been a long time coming. Ha, how can I forget? All right, y'all. So you gotta rinse off them fries because somebody wanted to eat some fries and, or potatoes that somebody been playing with. Yeah. Don't be trying to say we nasty over here. We rinse off our stuff. All right, now I gotta put them in the air fry. I gotta take my burgers off in a minute. Let's check on these burgers. Got a little burn. I like mine, burn. You too? Yep. We're gonna keep them on a little longer. I could have put one <laughs> Alright, so with the fries. We just got this air fryer too, by the way. Ours was broke, that's why we bought one. That's why we bought one. <laughs> like, you spend the money for no goddamn reason. Nah, the air fryer was broke. <laughs> Uh, I was thinking. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> but what we spend an extra money for. So, what I like to do is put some olive oil on the fries so the air fry can cook, you know, through these fries real good. See, one thing about being a teacher, you can talk with the olive oil a little bit so they can be oily and they'll stick together or be dry. Then, I season my fries. So I season everything with the same damn season. Everything. I don't care if it's chicken, steak, fries, whatever. I'm seasoning with the same shit. Slap your mammy. God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I know y'all might think this salty, but it ain't gonna be salty. It's just to have some flavor on the potato. The magic is in the whipperization. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm gonna season twice, not all the way, just a little more salt and some, um, what's my onion powder? You can't have garlic without, man. There's some of that seed, I mean, some of that onion powder going. And we gooch. All right, so I'm gonna pour half in here and then half in the other one. And then we're gonna cook these fries. All right, y'all, so I got both my fries. I'm gonna close them up, dual cook, air fry. That's the only thing about this. <clears throat> I say dual cook. All right. You gotta sink it, baby. I am, honey. Yes. That'd be, that's the only thing that's stupid ass shit. We're gonna put her on 350 and get started. Yeah, it is. So I'm gonna take these burgers off. Put the other burgers on there 
and then we're gonna come back. All right, y'all, so I'm about to put cheese on my burgers. I wanted to have that, that, that crispier, you know, way, but turkey ain't gonna do too much. And then I don't wanna dry it out, so I got some sharp cheese. Damn. We're gonna cut this cheese in half. That's what we're gonna do. <laughs> this is a big ass. This is a big ass piece of cheese, boy. Big ass cheese. Okay. <laughs> Put some cheese on that thing. Throw some cheese on that bitch. All right. I'm gonna let them do what they're supposed to do. Then I'm gonna start my avocado. Now, I wanted some guacamole. I seen the trainer do turkey burgers and guacamole because I'm not <clears throat> I'm not using bread so that's how I'm gonna eat mine everybody else probably gonna use bread but that's what we're doing so I'm gonna show y'all how I make guacamole hey y'all open it up you got a good knife damn you could twist him out then I get a spoon to scoop this avocado out. <coughs> so after I do that, I'm going to show y'all the rest. Yeah, dig. All right, y'all, let me get these burgers up out of here. So y'all can see that cheese is melting to perfection. Come on, Jesus. So now I know I can put six on this thing. Ah, oh, that's gonna be mine, y'all. Don't worry about it. Yes, sir. Shout out to having a smusher. This pure lime juice, I'm gonna take a little bit of this. Oh, my God. Shout out to Kevin Gates. He said this give you energy in the morning with a little bit of hot water. But it also keep your avocados green. All right, y'all, we gotta toss. We gotta check on our fries. Yes, sir. And we gotta check on our burgers. I didn't, I didn't uh, give it to you because I didn't know if you wanted it. It's that secret. It's a secret. <coughs> What's up y'all, it's your girl Neek G, the host, and today I'm back with another mukbang video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying? And what the goddamn hell y'all leave? Before I even introduce them, let's lift up in prayer. God is great and God is good. Let us thank him for our food. By our heads, we all be fed. Give us Lord our daily bread. Amen. Thank you, God. We all hungry and been waiting on this Thank meal. So, shout out to Cuzzo. Shout out to my doula. I'm going <laughs> to explain that later. But, let's take a bite. I just cooked these good burgers. Hey. Oh, thumbnail. Nigga. Everybody do these. Uh huh. Harry already bite mine. Uh huh. <laughs> mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's the one. I yeah. see. Mm hmm. Mm. It was a little sloppy, but. I don't give a damn. That's how it's supposed to be. So, y'all. Hmm? It's supposed to be sloppy. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, I ain't get. Yeah, they are. So, y'all. Let's bust it. Because I want a little bit of ranch, too, now. Nah. Alright, okay. I just cooked the, um. These burgers, shout out to Bird. She told me to film it. So I did. So y'all gonna check out that video. You can put it down good. We all doing videos over here. So you know what I'm saying? We getting shit done. However, um, I was about to say, I wanted to do a mukbang about labels with lesbians because she's a no label. And this nigga just said she was a dyke. Oh, dyke out here in these streets. <laughs> and me, I ain't even a lesbian, bitch. I'm tired of the labels. You ain't no label no more? I don't know how I have yet. Okay. Would you like being labeled? Mm -mm. I ain't no label either then. You just said you was a dyke. Not no more. That's what you just said. That's what I said. So you changed your mind? 
Why you change? Why you change your mind? Cause you don't wanna be nothing. I don't wanna be nothing. She ain't being nothing. Nobody being nothing. We ain't nothing. Oh, I'm something. <laughs> I just. We label. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna lie. I'm sick of the politics in it. I don't. Mm -mm. Facts. Just gotta be able to be yourself. Why we just can't yourself? be people? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> the way you feel comfortable carrying yourself. Right. Mm -hmm. I, I'm kind of over the whole saturation of, I'm going to call it LGBT victimization. <laughs> I, I'm going to go into detail. The rule book. Let's go. Robin Hood should not be bisexual. Why not? Why? Why are we tell me, tell me why not? Because why are we sexualizing him? When we was raised, when we was growing up, Robin Hood didn't have a boyfriend or a girlfriend. Okay, I so why he need either bisexual. one? Bisexual. Mm -hmm. I'm a little lost. It's Robin lost. Hood is bisexual. Mm. So what about SpongeBob? Now SpongeBob was different, mm -mm. but they never said SpongeBob was gay either. But you knew it, though. You felt it. Mm -hmm. I felt we gay. We felt it. In the spirit. We know. That episode with him and Patrick raised that baby together. Mm. I ain't see that. You ain't see that one? They raised a clown. Oh, Who yeah. That Cause it's behind you right there. Ain't it? Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what you say? What you say? They raised a clam together? They raised a clam together. Patrick was the daddy going out to work every day. SpongeBob was a stay at home mom. Mm -hmm. Girl. Where was that at? Man, you he had, had rollers and everything. Yeah, I thought it was a bonnet. <laughs> no, I don't remember that. Yeah, I, I don't know <clears throat> if it was a bonnet or roller. It was one of the two. But yeah. Well, Patrick was daddy. That's still a different generation. However, I do understand that times have changed. Mm. But why do you think Robin Hood should be bisexual? I mean, it's not that I think he should. It's just... I don't like the fact of people putting on labels for kids shows anyway right that's where it's, start, I'm it's starting from. too early for them you know as far as knowing something like that even though they may know they self i don't know i just think that it's it's being pushed just let the kids be the kids yeah they've been pushed that's like, what i mean sexually tight even though they know young some may know young yeah but i don't think it need to be pushed on people I don't either. I think people get it. You got lesbians and stuff like that out. That's you my point. It. So you I don't understand it. sexualizing the characters. And why? Why do we have to be focused around sexualization I'm, when it comes to being gay? I don't like the fact that we have to be like out in the open. Like why they have to Surround everything about us like something wrong with it. Or it just has to be Making so dramatic. Yeah. Like as if we requested it. Yeah. It's my thing. <laughs> That's why I'm just like, you know what? I'm just me. Hell, I'm sick of claiming this shit. <laughs> but I just, I'm not for sexualizing children's shows. Yeah. Like Spongebob probably should have never been on Nickelodeon. His ass should have been on AE or mm -hmm. EE. Whatever the fuck that shit was. Cartoon Network. Network. That. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what that shit should have been. Even with the Rugrats. Allegedly when that's they got old. Burger though. Oh. Let's talk about it. Five, boy. <laughs> at first you was just trying yeah. to. What is she trying to downplay at first? What you mean? You was like. Alright, alright. Like you weren't trying to give me my bro. I'm gonna give you flowers. You weren't trying to give me my proper I'm replacement. Give you flowers. Girl, okay, so my whip worked proper. It was good. Okay. All right. I'm glad you, you liked it. You the mush, all that. Cuz oh, you did good too. You had your mush going on. Appreciate that, girl. <laughs> you know, one thing you gonna do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What'd you say your girl had you playing that day? Sous chef. Sous chef. <laughs> that's all. Girl gonna be a sous chef. A sous chef, that's but it. No, no. Don't Ooh. ask me to cook. She gonna do the prep first. Yep. Yeah. Bird on film. Mm -hmm. I got you. So, <clears throat> I don't know when this video go, come, going out, but Bird is about to be my doula. Because y'all know I'm going to have a baby. Bird about to get me prepared for that. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. So, I had to give Bird that, that introduction because I know y'all like, who is Bird? 
<laughs> Bird is actually Cuzzo four times removed, but <laughs> she don't think we look alike, so it don't. Kinda. Kinda not. We look more alike though. But <laughs> two times. That's yeah. why you four time removed, cause you two times removed. This all right. Chocolate over here. Y'all you know saying? <laughs> Ain't that right, TT? TT, I'm not gonna Mmm. Is she over there? She said, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. be in and out. She said, yeah, I'm about to go enjoy my burger alone. Mm -hmm. Fast. actually got two burgers. Um, but yeah, y'all. I wanted to speak about that. Something quick for a little mukbang, and I wanted to enjoy these burgers and definitely put out some type of content. Because mm -hmm. that thing good. That thing good at all. get another one, man. I am. I'm mm -hmm. gonna get another one. Then I'm gonna get another one to take home. Oh, well. <laughs> we only got three left, Bird. I'm just saying that's what black people do. Oh, well. yeah. <laughs> Tissy, black people don't leave without a plate. Titi over there? Baby! Titi! Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. Dang! She left me. <laughs> I don't want that. Mmm. 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 Go ahead. Enjoy your mm -hmm. burger. Mm -hmm. No, usually when um, the person cook, they ain't be they don't be hungry. That ain't me. That ain't you. Okay. She but also, eating. I didn't eat nothing. She just cooked. Okay, eat nothing. Mm -hmm. Okay. I had one fry towards the end. <laughs> <laughs> mm. You hold out that. Then. Mm -hmm. I appreciate you. <laughs> mm. Appreciate that. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. This motherfucker busting. Oh, it is. That's nice, man. It's busting. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. So what we about to do? Dirty. Dirty. Yep. <clears throat> Alright y'all. We done with this video man. I just want to give y'all something a little quick. Something fast. I hope y'all enjoy it. Cause though you like the burger, you ain't saying shit. Man, the burger <laughs> good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sitting like over here nothing. thinking like, okay, I'm gonna jump in next time. Because <laughs> 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 It's the burger. The burger good, man. It is. Alright y'all. We're gonna go ahead and sign on out, man. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. I'm going to have Bird channel down below as well. But y'all, just stay tuned <coughs> to the videos and you will see why. All right. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.